Yeah, it's, it's unfortunate for, for Wilder because, you know, he's, he's ready to fight, he's ready to go, he wants to fight now, but everybody keeps failing drug tests, you know, and, and I think it's something like the third, third fighter in a row that is, is, you know, somebody's failed a drug test with him. Um, it's, just a, you know, it's just a bad part of the game at the moment and it, it's clearly needs sorting out. But as far as Wilder's concerned against Stavern, he's already beat him once when he was less experienced. Stavern's not really done anything since then. He's been inactive. He doesn't strike me as the kind of guy that keeps himself in fantastic shape in between fights because when he fights, he's quite, you know, he's, he's not the most ripped of athletes. Um, Stavern at his best is a very, very good fighter. Fast stands, tough, very, very tough. Um, but I don't see him being at his best now. And I think, I think Wilder will, will, you know, pick his spots to start off with. I don't think he'll go in there gun swinging straight away because he'll remember last time when he fought him and how tough Stavern was. But I do think that he will get rid of him and mid rounds. Uh, I think that's a, a mid rounds job. Um, I think Wilder's sharper. Is is you know he is more active. Um, he's more athletic, and I, and I think he does. He takes care of business, and then hopefully moves on to onto the big one.